Hi, I'm Lee McDaniel. I'm a farmer from Maryland, past president of uh, National Association of Conservation Districts. Um, I started it with my local district as an associate supervisor. Um, it was around 1990. Then I became a supervisor and I've been chairman of my board since uh, 2005. And I'm, even while I was serving at the National and also as the State Association President, I continue to be chairman on my local board. Um, I believe I've been involved with NACD at the board level for about 15 years. Um, I started out as a board member on the, on the national board, then spent five years on the executive board, which is only a four-year place to stay, but I had an extra year because uh, somebody from my region resigned, so I had to finish his term out. Then I became uh, first vice president of NACD, and then became president of NACD, past president of NACD, and now I'm just a regular member of NACD. NACD matters because it is the voice of the conservation districts at the national level. Um, we certainly need that voice to uh, advocate for USDA, for the NRCS, to make sure that the proper funding gets to the districts. We, we need to get that proper funding to the district, both for the financial assistance for the cooperator, but also for the staffing of the office to provide the, the technical expertise to the cooperators. So it's important to have that national presence in Washington to make sure that those funds flow through as they need to flow through. Sometimes, at least in, on the East Coast, and maybe the West Coast too, uh, agriculture gets a black eye and they are not the problem, they are the, they are the opportunity to be the solution for everything from climate change to carbon sequestration to um, stormwater infiltration. Uh, we're, we're the ones that have the answers to some of these problems. I, I think um, anybody that wants to get involved with NACD should get involved because you're making uh, a better world for the future. Whether it's conservation, education, environment, economics, we need to ha have the next generation have an opportunity to have a better world than, than the way we found it. Um, when you're at the NACD, it's just a large family because everybody that's coming from their home state has the same perspective, more or less, than. Uh, than you have and that, that just it's just a good family type of uh, situation since the time I've been involved I've seen it and it's actually grown and prospered pretty much each year from 15 years ago to where we are now and the trajectory is it's going to continue to grow and be more influential and more uh, prosperous than it has been in the past I think the future it looks good for NACD um, because we are addressing uh, environmental issues. Not only are we addressing environmental, environmental issues, but we're also uh, helping to protect the resource so future generations will have the opportunity to produce the food and fiber and energy that the world needs. We're gonna go away from conserving and more into the future to actually making uh, soil, water quality, and air quality better than what it was before. And I think our legacy is we've come from protecting things to actually making things better for future generations.